In Raven Simone's podcast, actress Keek Palmer discusses her sexual orientation in detail. Keek Palmer has informed her followers once more that she is not heterosexual. Earlier this week, the singer and actress appeared as a guest on Raven and Miranda's The Best Podcast Ever where she discussed how she came to grips with her sexuality as a teenager. The Emmy Award winner admitted in the podcast that she tried to hide her sexuality when she was younger, especially from her family, while speaking openly about her path of acceptance. Because I liked boys too, I was kind of like, well, we don't have to talk about it. There is like an unsaid thing that may make you feel. I enjoy guys too, so. In the podcast with Raven Simone and her wife Miranda, Palmer revealed that she eventually accepted her emotions at the age of 17. I ultimately just feel like the acceptance of that part of myself, in general, was a part of my process of being able to have love in my life, Palmer said. When the music video for her song I Don't Belong to You was released in 2016, the singer admitted she didn't like labels. Speaking to the media at the time, she explained that the idea behind the film was to portray the contemporary young lady. The video was to represent the young woman today, it's not the traditional woman anymore, she added. Are you gay? Am I bi? I don't have to adhere to any labels because I set the rules for myself. The 29-year-old actress gave birth to a kid named Leides earlier this year with her partner Darius Jackson. When Darius publicly ridiculed Palmer for the attire she wore to Usher's event in Las Vegas earlier this month, much of Palmer's relationship with Jackson became public on social media. Jackson uploaded a video of Usher singing to her during his performance along with the remark it's the outfit though. You a mom. Jackson sought to defend himself by saying, We live in a generation where a man of the family doesn't want the wife and mother to his kids to showcase booty cheeks to please others and he gets told how much of a hater he is. This was in response to the first outburst that he had made. He did not look well after the incident, and as a result of the negative feedback, he decided to delete all of his social media profiles.